So I'm gonna make this quick. Um, I took my bonnet off, put some clothes on. But yeah, this is what's under my bonnet, trying to moisturize. Um, okay, might have a little adventure later on today. I ordered a package that was supposed to be delivered Wednesday, last week. <sighs> it's been saying in transit, in transit, in transit. Fine, things happen. Rona. And I check <sighs> yesterday. It said it was delivered Friday. Lies. I was here all day Friday. My sister checked my mailbox Saturday while I was gone. Nothing. And it's a package. It's not anything big. It's something that they can put in like one of the little shippers, the bubble wrap things. It could drop down in the mailbox on the front of my door. Fine. So, I'm like, and then today it said, like, delivered, even from the company I ordered it from. I, I use um, an app that tells me, you know, when things are in transit, when it's delivered, and it said delivered. I said, nope, that's a lie. So, I put in a ticket. Where my shit? Pretty much. Um, and I was like, you know, I, I like calling. You could put in tickets, send emails, all that good stuff. I like to figure out what's going on, especially for something I paid my money for. And it was for a purpose, for a reason that I ordered this and I need it now. I mean, the point I got my tattoo is, I mean, it's healing now. So what? Um, I called and the lady was so nice because I was, mm, I was ready. But she was so sweet. She was so nice. Um, told me. Yeah, it. I saw that it was delivered um, to the post office and at like 4.50 and like, oh no, five minutes later it says it was scanned out and returned back to Amazon. I didn't order it from Amazon. I ordered it directly from a website. So she's like, hmm, we're trying to figure things out. I'm sorry, I'm looking at my work. Um, trying to figure it out she was like well maybe they reused an Amazon box and they were like no it's a company why would they reuse the box that's something I would do if I was shipping something out you know from you know just reselling something I would reuse an old Amazon box or Ulta box or something like that fine I would do that but this is coming from a company so we were like okay maybe not and then she asked me, did my post office have uh, Amazon lockers? I don't know. Because, I mean, I order from Amazon. <laughs> I got two things coming now. Um, I order from Amazon all the time. And I have it shipped to a locker. Especially if I know, like, the delivery date. And I know I'm not going to be home or close to home. I live on a busy street. I don't know my neighbors. I'm new around here. So I don't want my stuff just sitting out in the open. I know I'm not the only one. So I just have it delivered to a locker. It makes it more convenient. Gives me a few extra days to go pick it up. And I know it's there. I have the code to get it. I don't know if they have that at the post office though. It would I know they have post office boxes. But I don't know if they have um, Amazon lockers at the post office. So we were like, hmm, maybe that's it. Or maybe just somebody just got it wrong. That happens too. But you're messing with my stuff. You're messing with my monies, man. So luckily, um, the post office that delivers for my area is lit really down the street like I go down the street to the light make a left and I'm there I'm in the parking lot fine that's what I would do I was going to stay and do some overtime today things just keep messing me up I did clock in a little early this morning I know y'all saw my video this morning I was a little frustrated I was tired because people was messing around with my beauty rest Things have just been a little mm, today. But nevertheless, I will be there. I will be nice. I will be 
an adult about this situation. Because, no, you're not going to tell me something was delivered when it's not. So, I have a ticket in with the post office. I emailed the company. Uh, Y'all need to unmark this. Whatever. It ain't been delivered. I ain't got my stuff. Um, so, yeah. That'll be a little adventure later on today. I might take you guys with me. Um, uh, have y'all ever had any issues with the post office? I have never had an issue with the missing package. Um, things have been late, yes, but not this late. I'm talking about like a day or two. Granted, it it was supposed to be here Wednesday. It said it was delivered on Friday. So I'm going by Wednesday. That's a week ago. I've never waited this long for anything. One or two days. Okay. But never this long. Y'all ever had that happen? Mm. Maybe it's a sign I need to stop spending money online. At least online. Maybe. I don't know. Mm. Loving the sunlight. Oh, yeah, I can't see out the window. Yeah, just stretching. Moisturizing and stretching my hairs. I'm so random. I can jump from topic to topic without a thought. But, yeah, um, that's my day. That's been my day. Trying to figure out where. And it all it is is some Dagon um, tattoo balm for my tattoo. Which is starting the um, the peeling and scabbing process. Which looks nasty. But I'm used to it. Uh, this is number... This makes number 10 for me. And I have to text my guy a picture of another one that I want pretty soon get my thigh covered oh yeah okay focus um but no i'm about to focus on this work because i just asked my supervisor to send me some more work and i just sat here and i'm just sitting here staring at it but i'm gonna get on it yeah tell me your experiences uh with post office bad experiences <laughs> With packages, post offices, Amazons, DHLs, all the all the girls out there. Yeah. Have a good day.